Have you ever wondered if there are any foods out there that you can just eat endlessly because they have almost zero calories? Well, if you're trying to lose weight or just counting your calories right now, it can help to know what foods you can load up on without sabotaging all your hard work. And the truth is, there are a handful of foods out there that really count as zero calorie foods. But there are also several that have almost next to zero calories because they're so high in fiber. And you'll be surprised to learn that a lot of them can actually be pretty tasty. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing 11 foods that have almost zero calories. Now, I wanna be clear, when people talk about food having zero calories, it's important to know what that means. Every food has calories, but some foods have little to no impact on your blood sugar and metabolism because they have very few calories and your body uses up more energy just to digest them and burn them off. Now, before we dive in, if at any point you decide that you are enjoying this video, don't forget to smash that like button. And if you're not yet part of the V Shred fam here on YouTube, hit that subscribe button below so that you don't miss a thing. Let's get into the 11 foods that have almost no calories. So number 11, you got cucumbers. So cucumbers are mostly water and have virtually no calories. They're also one of the most versatile veggies out there because you can pack them into sandwiches and wraps and you can add them to green smoothies and load up your salad bowls with them to add some crunch and variety to your dish. You can just serve them on the side of some protein and rice. You can eat cucumbers with the skin on them to get the fiber and other nutrients from it. So you can eat cucumbers with almost any meal and they're pretty tasty in my opinion. Number 10, kale. So one cup of raw kale comes in at just 20 calories. Okay, so it's not zero calories, but it is pretty low considering how much volume one cup of kale actually is. And this is key, which is finding low calorie foods that add lots of volume to your plate because they help fill you up and they also make you feel like you're getting more food per sitting. Number nine, summer squash. So summer squash, or yellow squash, is 95% water. So it makes the list of super low calorie foods. And it looks a lot like zucchini and is considered to be a non-starchy vegetable. And an entire medium length summer squash has just 38 calories and eight grams of carbs, making it another great food for adding volume to your plate. Number eight shirataki noodles. So a lot of people actually call these magic noodles because they have almost zero calories, but shirataki noodles are made with fiber and water and nothing else. And so they're a great filler food when you want to keep your calories low and also don't want to feel deprived. Number seven, lemons and I'll throw in limes. So lemons and limes are packed with vitamin C and are great for adding to water or salads. One whole lemon has just 17 calories. And since you probably won't be eating the lemon itself, it's safe to say it has virtually zero calories. Number six, pickles. So pickles make for a great snack when you're craving salty foods. And you can even find pickle chips to give you the satisfaction of salty chips without the guilt. And pickles are basically just cucumbers that have been marinated in a vinegar mixture. So just like cucumbers, they have virtually zero calories. Just make sure that you watch your intake if you're worried about salt because these are typically drenched in salt and vinegar. Number five, sugar-free jello if you're watching your diet and have a bit of a sweet tooth. Sugar-free Jello can be a nice little dessert and packs only 10 calories per cup. Now, it is made with artificial sweeteners that some people don't like eating. And so if you like the idea of Jello, consider making your own with some fresh fruit juice and gelatin instead. Number four, zucchini. So most people don't know that zucchini is actually just another type of summer squash. And just like its yellow cousin, zucchini is also made out of mostly water. 
one medium zucchini only has about 30 calories. And whether you chop it, dice it, spiralize it, it's gonna add a lot of volume to your plate regardless. Number three, watercress. As its name suggests, watercress is made of 93% water, but is also packed with vitamin C. With only four calories per cup, Watercress can be a great choice for adding more leafy greens to your plate and making it virtually impossible to gain weight no matter how much you eat. Number two, bok choy. So if you're not a big fan of spinach, I recommend trying bok choy instead. Bok choy is considered to be a superfood because it contains selenium, vitamin C, and vitamin K. Plus it clocks in at only nine calories per cup. So you can absolutely load up on this leafy green so that you have more volume, you get more nutrients, and it'll help you feel more full. And number one, cabbage. The base ingredient for coleslaw is also one of the lowest in calories. Plus it's a great source of fiber, making it a must when you're trying to lose weight. One cup of shredded cabbage clocks in at just 17 calories and has over 40% of your daily recommended vitamin C. So make sure you include cabbage in as many dishes as you can to make them that much healthier. There you have it. Our top 11 foods that have virtually zero calories. And if you need help figuring out your diet, we can help you. I have a team of certified personal trainers that can create a completely customized meal plan for you based on your body and your metabolism and your goals. All you have to do is click the link down in the description below to take a free metabolic assessment and find out how we can help. And also, like I said, hit the like button if you enjoyed this video and hit the subscribe button if you're not part of the V-Shred fam here on YouTube. But I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one.